Hi guys, today I'll be showing you how to make a hip hop beat. Alright, so first of all, you want to get your um, piano just to lay down the basics. This might be a long video, but yeah, this is M by the way. And then go into piano roll. So you want to choose what key you're in. Um, I want to be in key C minor, let's say. These are all the notes that are in the C minor scale. C minor scale, meant. The C minor scale is also called the Aeolian scale or natural minor scale. So you want to lay down your first um, chords. This is the uh, first triad chord. This is called the um, C. This is a, a root chord for the scale. C natural minor. And then because you skip one note in between. Alright, so that's the first chord. And then you can take this and then you can, I, I don't know, just see that. Yeah, so that sounds good. Let's choose a BPM. This isn't going to be too sad, so I'm going to make it kind of bouncy. So I'm going to choose 115 BPM. You want to choose your bass notes first, and then you can lay down all the um, like the thirds and the fifths and the sevenths. Um, what I'm going to do here is I'm, just, I'm going to make this these ghost notes so I'm going to you just put that into a random selection and then I'm going to extend them so now you can see Yeah. So these are my ghost notes. Oh, you can use anything. Yeah. Um. So you can delete that now. And I can move that here. And to make it more rhythmic, you can make it like this as well. Oh, you want to mute the kick so you can't hear it. Some nice more rhythmic. I think I'm going to put an A minor chord down. So that just is some um, A and then C and then D. I'm probably going to add a seventh to it. So that's, that's the seventh chord now.
So you know you want to add the bass notes, so you just take the uh, lowest note over here and put it down here. Alright, so that's G and then A. This should help you make your bass sound as well. And your eight A's. So that sounds like much, it has a more dynamic range to it. So now we can add the melody at the top. You can add this. Just go with the flow. Like add just notes in here. So I have to say something about it. Okay. <coughs> oh, that sounds a bit off. Because these um, chords are over here, I'm gonna just um, I'm just gonna make this um, like about half a step forward. Uh, so you can do that by um, going over here and do it. That. So now I can just easily fine tune that. So you just want to um, try and try and keep the white notes in the background over the here. You can just choose any channel for that, but I chose kick. You can add a legato by doing control and L. So let's see what it sounds. So that's a chord progression done. But I think I'm just going to move that so it's more in tune. 
mein ähm, kann man sehen. Ja, was auch mein. Okay, now you wanna um you wanna try and get a good kick. Alright, so let's go to Let's go to Metro Booming Drum Kit. Right, we have here. Alright, don't judge me, guys. I use, well, sometimes do you use the um, uh, default pack of drums. I think I'm gonna stick with this one. So you can just do right click on that and then three or every four steps. Something's out of time in the beginning, so I'm just gonna fix that. Alright, this might be a long video, by the way, so. Just stick around to the end and be sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon yeah that sounds much better now That's our full boss um, looped on. Now we can add some hi hats. Okay. Actually, now wait. Um, we could just do for every two steps. Sometimes you add like triple, um, triple bumps and yeah, like over here. Then we we'll get like a good snare or like a clap, something that sounds similar to each or either. That sounds a bit low, so I'm gonna um, quantize it up a bit. Alright, 
I'm gonna get rid of these. I'm also gonna add a snare to um the stack for those. change up the um the hi hats I'm starting for IC3 high hats. Then we get the A to eight, so. So let's go to the grand piano. We can just, um, Copy all of that bass notes and then put it into here. I'll bring up the auxes, so I'll do control and up arrow. I just realized my um, hi hat, so actually. Um, let's see, yeah. Get like some GMS. Get some nice synth sounds or some leads or pads.
Now you can just copy and paste your um your oh, no your grand piano into your GMS. I think I'm going to change up the GMS just a bit. Now you can add some bass. I think I'm gonna choose So now
Willkommen. Okay, that's good. I decided a um one of these um FL Studio loops from loops. Okay, now now I can add all of these to my mixer. So basically, you just have to highlight them all by clicking them. Oh. So get them all out, and then yeah, and then go to your mixer, which should be over here. And then do Control Shift L, and then it will all be aligned with the corresponding names and everything. So now you you might want to add some reverb. I'll show you this. That sounds good. Okay. Now I might turn this down a bit. And turn up my bass. For this beat, I'm going to add a cello. Just to make it a bit spookier. This time I'm just going to do the chords.
Hopefully it should turn that down. I'm going to pitch that down one octave. So I pitched it down two octaves. I think that sounds a bit more like a cello, I guess. So now I can unmute everything else. Now I can, um, this is called a trick, so basically, you, um, to split all of these into their own separate channels, you have to go click this arrow here next to pattern 1, and then do split by channel, so now it all splits it all down into their own channels. So now we can go into arrangements, so first I'm probably going to add the piano, and then I can snoop this and make sure to make it precise you need to click this magnet looking thing here and then do <coughs> beat so it, it like sticks to it six the nearest beat so that's a handy little trick there So I'm just arranging the grand piano down and then um, I can do and snare and then keep that going until here and I can add the hi-hats and everything else as well. I think I'm going to move all of this down and then I can put GMS over here the bass
going to turn up the Geo Grover loop. I actually did that so I'm going to turn it back here and now I can you can really hear that we reboot though Okay, that's, so I think that beat's done now. Anyway, that's it for the beat. Thank you for watching. Thank you, bye.